If you're looking to boost your conversion rates and make the checkout process faster for your customers, creating dynamic checkout button is one of the most effective way. So let's dive in how to create that button in Pagefly. For example, I will add that button to this product page. First, on the left-hand menu, go to Elements, select Pagefly tabs, and scroll down to find the HTML liquid element. Simply drag and drop it into the page editor, making sure it's placed inside the product details element. Keep in mind, this only works within the product details section. Next, head over to the general tab and open the code editor. Then, paste this code into the HTML liquid code editor. You can find the code in the description below. This element will only show up in the live view. To make the button more appealing, you can add more style for it by adding custom code. First, I'll add a class for the button in the HTML liquid code editor. Let's name it something like Pagefly Custom Button. Once that's done, click the Done button. Now, head down to the bottom left corner and open the custom code editor to access the custom CSS code modal. Here's the code, you can find it in the description below. For those who aren't too familiar with coding, don't worry, you can just copy the Add to Cart button's code from the CSS modal, paste it here, and tweak the values to your liking. All set. Now, just save and publish the page to see how it looks in the live view. Almost done, don't forget to set the payment in Shopify admin. For example, I will choose the payment as PayPal. From your Shopify admin, go to Settings, Payments. Click on Activate PayPal, or you can add other payments. After everything is done, let's take a test transaction to confirm that everything is set up properly. And there you have it. You've successfully added a dynamic Buy It Now button to your product page, giving your customers a faster and more convenient way to check out. This concludes our tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe for more helpful videos. Thank you for watching.